everyone welcome to my channel my name is Corey and today I'm going to be doing a DIY I'm going to be doing a lemon welcome sign and I'm going to use all uh, chalk paint olive oil and then I'm going to use my white paint by Apple Barrel and I'm probably going to use I'm not too sure I might use uh, sage also chalk paint but I'm not too sure if I want to use this just in case if I do I'll let you know okay <clears throat> so what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to put my tape and I'm also going to be using one of these wood rounds, okay. And I'm going to go ahead and start taping it so I could paint it halfway. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and add uh, <clears throat> my uh, paint to it. And I'm going to go ahead and start with the olive oil paint. And of course, these are by Hello Hobby. I get these at the Walmart store. And I'm just going to go ahead and start at the top with this paint here and see how that works. Okay, now I'm just going to finish painting the rest of it white, which I had to wait for it to dry in order for me to put my tape up here. decided not to use the color stage on it after all so I just used my olive oil chalk paint and the white by Apple Barrel so those are the only two paints that I decided to use and I'm gonna go ahead and use uh, 
a stencil. It's a it's a welcome uh, lemon stencil, and that's what I'm gonna be using on my sign today. And I got this stencil is from um, Walmart where I had purchased this stencil. And I had it, I got this a while back, so. Okay, and I'm just going to center this um, to the middle a little bit. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more right there. And I'm going to go ahead and just tape it down a little bit. So it doesn't move on me. I stencil this. And I am using a oh, painter's tape. Okay. And I get this one at the Dollar Tree. And I usually like to put a little bit of this on while I stencil so it won't move on me. And makes it easier for me to stencil. Okay. And I'm going to start off with, um, I think I'm going to start off with the green first. Yeah, I'll start off with the green first. And then I'll maybe use the yellow. So I'm going to use uh, the green from Apple Barrel. Okay. And I'm going to start off by painting the the leaves and I'm gonna be using one of these little uh, brushes which I got these also at the Walmart store they had a whole pack you could get a lot of them you get them in different sizes you get them like in in these bigger sizes and you get them in a smaller size and this size right here and usually, I when I'm gonna stencil, I usually like to dap it a little bit on my wax paper before I end up uh, stenciling, and that way it I don't over put too much paint, or maybe so it won't leak so much.
Next color, I'm going to go ahead and use my yellow. And that one I'm going to be using this one. My apple barrel also, my yellow one. the beads, of course, but for 
first I gotta glue this and before I add the two the beads to it. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn this back, add a little bit of glue to it. this on That way you'll know when my next video will be up. Some things I do put here on YouTube and some things I just put them on Instagram. So I hope you all have a beautiful and wonderful evening or day. And thank you for watching. Bye. I love you guys all. Take care. Bye-bye.